So the two things that you're dealing with when you're dealing with licensing is master and sync licenses. You can either get a check for $2,000, but if you own the publishing, you're going to get a check for $4,000. Most libraries and licensing services take half of the upfront money. Many libraries also try to take your publishing. There's actually a lot more money if you can figure out how to license yourself. One of the biggest mistakes that people make is they don't have any idea where they're sending their music to. If you dig around the sites and do a little detective work, sometimes you can find out some contact info. And then you type in music supervisor with quotes around that. So you have to make them believe that you're for real within the first five seconds of either a phone conversation or an email. Your CD is just another CD in the sea of CDs. If it's slimline, when it's in this stack, no one's going to see the spine because there's no spine. How long is the appropriate amount of time before you follow up? They'll cross you off the list right away and they have long memories about that stuff too. Over 90% of musicians don't know how to do this. Uh, most of the people doing this are making money off musicians because musicians can't get it together.